Nice. All right, return to him. <laughs> Crash a lock. Classic. <laughs> uh, fine display. You truly do possess the spirit of Andron's warrior legacy. I will rally my best fighters. Your foolish king will have his war. Very good. Your help will be appreciated and well rewarded. We need nothing to finally trample the fools of the capital beneath our heels. Is reward enough? Untamed, hear me! The hour of our vengeance has come! Gather your weapons! Harness your beasts! Today, we show the galaxy the true strength of Onderon! Getting ready to bark any second. Return to the lodge. All right. Make our way over there. He's staring at me. Back inside. Uh, what's next? See her tail going off. I'm telling you, an idiot doesn't come up with a pun like that or speak a forgotten language. <laughs> Insane, perhaps. Xenophobic, bigoted, murderous, all fair. But he's not an idiot. Not the bigger idiot, anyway. Debating relative idiocy, are we? They can't decide who's more foolish, Petrif or Akoru. Really now? Me too. Onderon, your conquering king returns. After this day, none will question my power. <laughs> Excuse me? Uh, he said you're sure to win, almighty king. I am indeed. Our noble forces await us to war. Between Petrif and Akuru, the capital's security forces should be adequately distracted. While they attack the main gate, my droids will blow open the city wall near a sewer bypass. That will be your entry to the orbital defense cannon's control center. Once you destroy the Republic fleet in orbit, our victory on Corellia will be one step closer. I'm ready. Let's, begin. Let's set out at once. First, there is one other matter. Once the fleet is dealt with, I'd like you to regroup with Petrif and his troops. If you aid them in defeating Senator Nibet and her Republic allies, Petrif can rule unchallenged as the Empire's puppet. Onderon would be ours. I'll do what I can to help Petrif. Thank you. His stupidity will benefit the Empire for decades to come. I will deploy my droids to clear a path. Good luck, Commander. This will be a day long remembered. Very good. Very, very good. Feeling a bit better now? All right. Try calling him again. I'm honored. And then we'll send the rest. Sounds like a plan. Here, take this. I won't disappoint you. Understood, sir. Alright, where's the closest? I think this might be the closest. 
And then I think we can take a uh, taxi over to the, the next location. Destination? Possibly. Maybe not. So it's right there. Uh, shoot. What's the best route? Could go there, could go there, could go here. <laughs> I say I might go here just to... <sighs> sure. Enjoy your stay. We'll see if there's like any sort of uh, closer path to take. Or it might just be dropped in and then have to go that route anyways. Yeah, that's my work. As long as I get to that pathway, then this should be fine. Oh, wow. Look at that. Not bad at all. That worked out. Find the maintenance entrance. These sewers. Ah! What are you doing down here? Like this canister or volatile chemicals. chemicals. Are you certain? I suppose we don't have a choice. Good luck. Detonate the canister.
probably at least one more mob that's gonna pop out around this corner. Would you look at that? Series of shots. Corsa, that, pole, and long shot or lethal shot. Nice. It's down too. Very good. Palace command. We need to go to a different level. Wait, what? You found the main entrance. What do you mean? We're inside the building. What? Why is my objective find the main entrance? <laughs> So they're all taken down. Uh, you can't seem to go this route. I keep pressing J to look at the thing too. All right. Go back down to the sewer access. It says find the ma maintenance entrance. Stop the invaders! Defeat the guards. I already did that. The heck? The guild or the the uh the quest is like lagging out. What do I do if I already defeated the guards? Yo man, I was wondering what server to join since coming back to Swore Tour. Is the Teal Shan and Star Forge more, more active? I believe, if I'm correct about this, I believe Star Forge is more. Um, back when I I went through the same thing, and Star Forge was the uh, mostly the uh, preferred one. I think Satil Shan is pretty active. I mean, like, I think it's pretty close. But I'm pretty sure Star Forge is the most active one, and it's also East uh, East Coast. Both servers are East Coast, but um, so Teal Shan is made for East Coast, and then uh, Star Forge is made for East Coast, and then Satil Shan is made for um, West Coast people. But the server's still on the East. Are you on Star Forge? Yes, I am on Star Forge. I have about like two or three characters on Satil, but I'm pretty sure a majority of people are on Starforge. If I'm correct, I think I could be wrong, but I, I'm pretty sure because when I, I remember looking that up also, because I wanted to be on the server with the most people as well. So, 
There needs to be RP guilds, yeah. Um, but yeah, I actually just returned back to the game today, too. So I'm playing through the new expansion, trying it out, seeing how it is, and then probably gonna level my character, do some other stuff, and then go from there. I will leave immediately. Uh, I got a broom. Yes. Thanks for the tips. Yeah, no problem. Hey, a kill of the hunt. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. And no problem. Uh, I might need to reset the quest because it's it really is messed up. How does one reset the quest though? Uh, is there... Maybe if I log out and back in, will they respawn? We can try. <laughs> like the worst time possible. Okay. Three, two... really stuck actually though cool Do I have to actually leave this entire place in order for this to reset? Ugh. Please, don't make me. I think I actually have to reset the entire mission. That sucks. <sighs> Wait, not that one. This one. Set. At least the enemies weren't too difficult. Let's make sure that it actually updates this time before we walk into that room. Alright, good. It looks like this time it actually saved a lot of my settings from the last time I played also. The last few times that I came back to the game, like all of my character slots were gone, like all sorts of stuff were messed up. But it looks like it was pretty seamless this time. Seventy two. You need to move fast. Nice. 
that orbital strike, man, it still does a lot of damage. It always feels longer than it actually is. Explosive chemicals. Trying to Are you certain? Or having to redo the missions again. Good luck. I'm on it. She worked. Hurry! You must reach the orbital controls inside the palace. Find the maintenance entrance. Alright, so we're back similar to where we were at last time. These dogs are going off the walls right now, downstairs. That's good. Reach the orbital defense. Now it's finally working. Good. Here, take this. If we must. Fight if we must. It is not too late. Surrender. Jeez. He went down pretty bad. Oh, that was the paddle. I thought it was it the Jedi Master. Late. Surrender. Huh. It is not too late. Surrender. It is not too late, surrender. The force guides me. Failed. Nice. Use the orbital defense controls. Disable, destroy the Republic fleet. Let's disable them. Savit, come in. The cannons are disabled. Petrif or Akoru must have damaged the power grid in their attack. <sighs> Blasted fools. <laughs> we'll think of something else once the palace is secure. Please, hurry to the throne room. All of my droids have been destroyed. I have no visibility. 
But if you ensure Petrif's victory, I'm sure we can find another way to disable the Republic fleet. Please. This is our last chance. Savik out. Find the throne room. Sure that we still have some people running these. Okay, there's no tens. Understood, sir. Restraining bolt disengaged. Go that way. I didn't hit all of them with the corrosive dart, but they all got it. I did hit all of them with this though. Grenade that spears pointed. Five minute radius or five meter radius. Yeah. Huh. Nice. Burn rooms to the left here. Anderon will return to the old ways, the pure ways. Your blood will wash away centuries of desecration. <laughs> you don't fight for Anderon. You fight for your own bigoted agenda. You fight, and you lose. His loss is my gain, Nabet. I've beaten you. I've won. Did you really believe you could steal the throne of the great King Petrif? Steal your throne? What in blazes are you talking about? No sense lying now. Your treason is over. I've won. I honestly wish I could kill them both. But I'm too good for all that. You, you fight for the Empire, <laughs> Petrif. What have you done? I have secured the prosperity of my planet forever. Now I rule Onderon, not the Republic and not you. You're a pawn, Petrif. Don't you see? You've doomed our world! A Republic Senator is a valuable prisoner. We look forward to learning everything you know. I knew you were a fool. But I never dreamed you could do something like this. I can do Oof. anything, Nebet. I am King. King! king. The worst kind of king. You, step forward. Your service to my rule shall never be forgotten. The people of Onderon will cheer your heroism for centuries to come. It's been an honor serving you, King Petrif. You shall always be a welcome guest in my palace. Now then, so many matters to attend to. I must take stock of things. Please, inform Darth Savik of our great victory. Okay. 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 One sec. There we go. Oh wow, we got some new abilities too. Return to Darth Savik with your chat with her in just a second here. I have some information you may be interested wow. in. This concludes Activate our business. Ability marks your current location for 10 minutes when this ability is activated again. If you're within 60 meters of the mark location, you instantly return to the mark location. 
It was on cooldown for 120 seconds. Oh, that's pretty cool. It's the wrong way. Yeah, it's awesome. So how does it work? The Republic fleet escaped. Well, they have escaped for now. But with Onderon in our control, all is not lost. The Republic fleet escaped. This is only a setback. We have countless alternatives to pursue. The Republic fleet Wait, escaped. E. Savik failed, <laughs> but her death won't solve anything. You will depart for Corellia at once. We will find a use for you yet, Savik. <sighs> yes, my lord. Commander, y thank you. Model. Yeah, you're, you're welcome. Live in legend, yeah, do you without. <laughs> Sorry, I had to head out early today. Or yesterday. From the start. But this welcome back. King Appreciate Petrif. it. Is he of use to the Empire? <sighs> is he of use? He's a fool. Petrif is an idiot. Without us, he'll get himself killed in a matter of weeks. Then we shall let him die. We have no more time to waste. Onderon has been an abject failure. Another fleet of Republic reinforcements is docking at Megshar, as Darth Valron predicted. That will be your next objective. Rendezvous with Valron's forces and ensure he succeeds where Savik failed. Malgus out. So, nice. what's our next stop? Set course for Megshar. Ah, we know it well. <laughs> A mine Hopefully got asteroid That's awesome. converted into a fueling station. What are you trying to get? We would love to join you. If you think your alliance has room, of course. Please? Please? It's been a pleasure working with you again. Welcome to the Alliance. Nice. Wonderful. Cars on board. I have a shuttle prepped and ready, shall we? Here we go. Nice. Level 73. Grab this. So what happens if I click that? Okay, sweet. That's pretty cool. So it takes you back to the exact location. Oculus Quest. Nice, dude. That's awesome. I love my uh my rift. It was definitely worth getting for sure. I'm um I think I'm actually about to take like a ten minute this? break though and make some food. So I'm pretty hungry. I'm trying not to eat a lot today because Thanksgiving is tomorrow. So um I'm just gonna put it on my BRB screen. And then go make something and then i'll be right back and we can uh continue the story so all right what is going on people i am back i'll get right on it and i will leave immediately now we can continue right where we left off i have just about a little bit over an hour left for today so once that's up, uh, I am actually going to have to get off for a bit since I'm actually now going to go see um, Ford versus Ferrari with my dad. So, let's hit that and keep doing some of the missions here. Hopefully we can get some more done uh, before I have to head out for the day. But, that's the plan for now. That is the plan. Oh, 
Space bar to continue. You will realize. Commander, welcome to Mitchar, Shar, outlaw crossroads of the galaxy. Darth Shar, I'm pleased we finally have an opportunity to work together. I've heard such delicious things about you. I serve Darth Varon, head of Imperial Logistics and Civil Order. He asked that I aid in supervising this operation due to my experience with the galaxy's criminal element. This intriguing specimen is a member of the Brothers our key allies on the station. They've provided the Empire with quality slave labor for many years. It is our great honor to take those without value and give them value. To Brother. give labor to those without purpose. Why don't you tell me your plans for Mekshar? As direct as your reputation. Huh. Tell me your plans. His gun keeps getting his rifle on the back keeps Our getting goal caught. Here is more complex than in the it cave. Might seem. Let's step into the operations center to discuss the details. Wait. There's some <gasps> what? What the oh! What is going on? Serious assassin. They bother you. I hope it's not me. Guy's actually taking a lot of hits. There we go. Who you handicap for one hundred percent and can't walk, but can, can I still play VR? Yeah, um, a lot of them actually. Have, um, I have no idea, but I a lot of the uh, seated Anytime. options. It's good to see you, you can again. pretty much play any game. Um, Lord Shaw, still for the most piece? part, there are some like harder times when like if oh. something drops on the floor, oh, yes. it's harder to get up. But if your the sensors can see it, with him. then yeah. Pity he didn't stand a chance. When I started out playing so VR, I actually did do and all seated during a top priority mission. You must have done something truly stupid. Like, I was sitting, like, This didn't right feel here, like an assassination pretty... attempt. Something else is going on. But now I usually stand Intriguing. up and do it. But a mystery for later, I think. We'd best return to the mission at hand. Shall we? Also, if you're on Steam and things like Greetings. that, you can see... You can filter by Council. seated play It is a pleasure well. to have you join us for this mission. I overheard something of a commotion. Is Darth everything all on. right? Someone attempted to kill our dear guest. An assassination attempt. Dreadful. I do apologize. Uh, I'm not convinced it was an assassin. It felt more like I was being tested. Really? I shall task some of our people with tracking the assailant down. I would love to <laughs> learn more. Yeah. Now then, Char, let's go over what we planned. Uh, 
A Republic fleet key to the defense of Corellia has taken position nearby and intends to purchase fuel from Mekshar in order to continue their journey. It is our task to ensure that this fleet never reaches its destination. So we stop them from refueling? Unfortunately, that wouldn't fulfill our Empress's command. If the fleet cannot acquire fuel, they'll simply consolidate what fuel they have into their most powerful warships and send them on. We do not have sufficient vessels to prevent this, and we must make every effort to stop the entire fleet. Oh, we will. Then we lure them in and attack while they transfer the fuel. Just so, my friend. Major Anri, explain your discovery. It just so happens that a perfect weapon is built into this rock. All we have to do is take control of it. See, this place used to belong to the Huts. Till their slaves revolted what is going on on our now belt? Now neutral, <laughs> run by the five biggest crews on the it's station. It's like freaking out. Breaker, she led the revolt. Well, she wanted to be sure nobody could show up and steal what she and the other slaves just won. So they put in a fail safe. It fires a pulse that neutralizes all the fuel in Mekshar's tanks, plus whatever's in the fuel lines, and any ships attached. We could even juice the pulse up a bit, make it strong what? enough to ignite the fuel everywhere but the tanks. Fry every ship in the fleet. Can you play on your bed? We or is it better in a wheelchair? Honestly, probably better in the wheelchair. To sell fuel but to it, the I think it's really depending needed. on, it depends on a majority where you set up your sensors. Crew. If you set it up so you can sit on your bed them or something like that, then yeah, it, I don't see I any different. It really wouldn't be a difference, but you have the, perfect the issue is if like started. something's in front of you, Brother? like Huffbreaker depending on how much you can move forward to get to it. Material wealth gained without effort. The five strongest crews are invited. You join our dear friends at Hutbreaker's auction. Ensure that the crews vote in favor of selling the fuel. And help the Republic slip its head into the noose. Consider it done, Lord Shah. If any other developments Easy. occur in the meantime, we will inform you at once. And watch your back. At least one of these crews is already in the Republic's corner, or the fleet wouldn't have come here in the first place. Best of luck. All right. Want to play Beat Saber, dude? Same. I've I've been wanting that game for so long, but I haven't gotten it yet. I, I was just playing uh, the last two days I was playing um, Creed. Uh, it's their Rocky slash Creed the movie game. It's pretty good. It's a lot of fun. I actually punched the crap out of my microphone. This right here by accident yesterday and it really hurt because I, I was standing all the way back there. Like I was playing, punching, punching, and then it made me move forward. So I punched as hard as I could and it went right into my microphone, like the mic stand. Uh, it hurt so bad on my thumb. And I was like, ah. After that, I had to stop for a second. <laughs> I'm just glad I didn't punch like my screen or anything. Because that has happened to other people. It's weird. You, you kind of forget like that there are stuff in front of you. But I thought there was plenty of room. I thought I was wrong. Only as be well. So, uh, got to be careful with that kind of stuff. Wow, I didn't realize that. Here, take this. What is this? This classic book. We call him out then. Of course. Companion. What's the difference? Ah. So one he has the robotic arm, the other one he doesn't. It's kind of cool. All right, I'll, I'll give him his regular look. Classic look. Well, Arkham back. I'm honored. Standing getting into the game. Dude, I was so into it. Like, I wasn't even thinking about that. It hurt. <laughs> like, VR is weird at first. It's so weird at first. Like, getting your mind used to it, I think, is the hardest part. But then, like, once you're like, okay, like, you kind of accept that it's not actually there. And then you kind of, like, ease yourself into it. Dude, there's some really cool parts. 
really cool things you can do in it. Be well. Like VR isn't even perfect in its current state, but it's it's very impressive either way. Unexpected setbacks. I have a, I have a good amount of VR games that I do want to re uh, play for the first time, like story wise. Um, other things too. I want a good like story VR game, but I have like three action games. Um, Ready for departure. That I want to play. Just haven't gotten to them yet. And there's a lot out there. There's a lot of free games too, which is cool. A lot of free like experiences. There's like two st free Star Wars games. Um, there's a lot of free stuff that Oculus has too. There's a lot. I totally almost just fell over in my chair. Yeah, it's, it's only going to get better too. One sec, I forgot to respond. Commander, uh, told me you were on your way. We're waiting for you inside. Una capahuna. Una capahuna. Already working on it. 